And that was our Triple Mac tracks for the night. Started off there with Bailey Rose and The Rearview and Me, Corey Farley with Wear the Hell Out of That Dress, and Brandon Stedman and Girl Like You. Chase the Night is a local Brisbane band, a brand new single out. Thought we'd better catch up with them. And uh, Kyle and Daniel join us now. Boys, congratulations on the new single and uh, the group that is Chase the Night. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Hey, um, now, it's probably not, but I'm going to put it out there anyway because you will have made my night if you've started a country song with a theremin. But uh, is that a synthesizer or a theremin in the music? It is a synthesizer. <laughs> uh, you know, it would have been so cool to be playing the theremin, <laughs> wouldn't it? Well, yeah, it probably were that good. <laughs> Maybe down the track. Okay, I've played this song to a few of my friends and they're sort of going... Wow, that's sort of like a country dance mix already because we have a lot of older country songs that are in dance nightclubs and that, and you've already mixed that all together. Was that something you guys set out to do? Yeah, I guess from from the beginning we're sort of trying to branch into a new sound, I guess, trying to just searching for our sound. And we spoke to our mix engineer and and he is right into synth, so he um, had a bit of an idea in his head as well. We really like the, um, you know, those upbeat types of songs, uh, country pop, um, listen to a lot of the American country stuff coming out of Nashville and trying to fill a void in Australia. And music's an evolution, isn't it, boys? That's what it's all about. Yeah, it's about creating, I guess, new sounds and experimenting, I guess, as something that we all should be aiming to do as as musicians. How do you go with the ones who come up to you and go, that's not Johnny Cash? (laughs) Oh, yeah. um, (laughs) Oh, you wouldn't have heard that, would you? No, oh, well, I've, I've had a few people that say, oh, that's, um, that's, that's different. And I said, yeah, yeah, it is. It's uh, in terms of, I guess, country music, I guess there's no, there's no boundaries. I... And like you say, country music's evolving. I mean, you know, now there's uh, country hip-hop, country R&B, country rock's been, I mean, going, in, especially yeah. in Australia, you know, for the next last 20, 30 years. I want to touch on um, not only the film clip, we do want to talk about the film clip, but I want to talk about the bloopers reel because I think that is absolutely awesome everybody loves bloopers and i keep saying to a lot of the artists why don't you give us a blooper track like when you're in the studio and you make bloopers and things like that so thank you guys for letting the blooper reel of your film clip come out over youtube (laughs) yeah it was a bit of uh it was a bit of fun making that video clip so we thought oh we should definitely definitely put out a bloopers reel because there were just times i I wish we videoed more of them because there were times where we just made so many mistakes and we had serious concerns for the young girl and at susie when she uh (laughs) fell over the gate we honestly thought she uh did damage to her um elbow but she uh got straight back up and just said she had um some of her hair in her eye that's what caused her to fall (laughs) but it is okay i'll admit i laughed when she went down too but i'm glad that she's okay the actual film clip um whose idea was it was it a bit of a collaboration between yourself or did you look outside for help for the idea? Uh, we, um, I guess we, we sat down on the Wednesday night before we filmed it, which we, we filmed it on a Saturday, and then the Wednesday before we, we sat down together and basically wrote the story as you saw it. We uh, pretty much wrote the story, did all the filming, um, used, we created our own little jig to do the camera work. It was all a uh, self-made project. Yeah. And the equipment, is that all yours, boys? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I sat... Um, working with my dad at home just over a weekend, created a little camera crane and a camera slider to get ready for it, and then we were set. Daniel and Kyle, thank you very much for joining us. We are talking about the band Chase tonight. Uh, get onto their Facebook pages, their YouTube videos. Um, I suppose you guys are on Instagram and Twitter and all that sort of stuff as well, are you? We're yet to create an Instagram account. We'll get there eventually. <laughs> oh, eventually. You'll, you'll get there. But we can find you on Facebook. Yes, you can, yeah. The yep. single is out there now. It is called Out in the Country. Hop on, have a look. And can the guys buy it on iTunes and all that sort of stuff yet? Yeah, you can find it everywhere. iTunes, um, it's on Spotify. We've got it on one rpm google play amazon apple music anywhere pretty much anywhere that online distributor until we get a an ep with a cd out that's i guess the way you'll get it stand by for the record label but here's chase the night now and out in the country